Goodbye, old friend. So I just came to the realization that I drink way too many energy drinks. I drink two of these a day, that's four servings. There's two servings in one of these. I drink two of them a day. In an eight hour period, I drink two of those monsters. I'm gonna challenge myself over the next week to not buy any monsters or any energy drinks at all. And I'm going to try and stop drinking them, live a little bit healthier. After that, I'm gonna try and quit something else that's not good for me. And eventually we'll just be better. <laughs> I'm also trying to train myself to uh, look at the camera and not at myself in the picture. Cause if I look at myself, I'm not engaging with you guys, I'm engaging with myself. So I'm trying so hard to block off me in the screen and just look at the corner of my phone. Um, I could flip the camera around so I only see the cameras and I don't see the screen, but I also like knowing that I'm positioned where I wanna be in the frame. So it's a habit I'm trying to break out of and eventually we'll get through that. So, so far February hasn't uh been the best on january 30th my great grandma passed away uh around 5 p.m eastern so i'm a little bit sad a little bit discouraged but i'm not gonna let that stop me from creating content i love creating content and it's it's a sort of like a therapeutic type of thing for me to make videos whether it's just random rambling ramblings or talking about a topic. That being said, I am going to do something other than just ramble today, and I'm gonna to talk to you about a tool that I use uh, pretty frequently. So I'm gonna be talking about my stream light that I showed you in my leather working video. Uh, before I get talking about it, I am going to be showing off all the modes for this flashlight, and one of the modes is a strobe light. So that being said, if you're sensitive to that, I will put a uh, timestamp of when the strobe light is going to happen and a little disclaimer right before because I don't want to hurt anyone. I don't remember exactly how many lumens it is but it's definitely sufficient. I mean it's bright like bright blind out the camera kind of bright. You have your bright mode, you have medium, and you have dark. This is as low as it gets and that's still really bright. Here comes the flashing light warning. It's I'm gonna run it for about three seconds so Here's the strobe, and that's it. No SOS, it's really simple. I even think the strobe might be a little bit too much, but you know, that's okay. This flashlight runs on a 18650 Streamlight battery. I believe this is 18650, looks like one. Uh, it is a lithium ion. And the, the light itself comes with two of these batteries and a piggyback charger. So you plug the flashlight in here, and then it has a, another section beside it right here that you can put another battery in and have them both charge at the same time. However, for the price point on this, I think it was $138. I think you can get about the same quality of light for cheaper. It's just, do you want the warranty? I wanted it whenever I was a mechanic because it's very beneficial to be able to see things when it's dark looking in an engine bay or up inside a frame. And now I use it on my night shift at work. I give this light a seven out of 10. It's better than most lights I've had. It has its downfalls and they really missed out on a opportunity to make it adjustable, make the beam adjustable. It has a really nice grip, a really good texture that hasn't really scratched. That's about as bad as the damage gets right there. So that's my rating for the light. I think you can get cheaper ones. The only thing they don't cover is if you lose it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.